police commission affirms Abakari's suspension over Hush Puppies multi-million dollar fraud. The Police Service Commission has suspended Abakari, a deputy commissioner of police and head intelligence response team of the Nigerian police force from the exercise of the powers and functions of his office. Abakari's suspension took effect from Saturday 31st of July 2021 and would subsist pending the outcome of the investigation in respect of his indictment by the FBI of the United States. The commission has also directed the Inspector General of Police to furnish it with information on further development on the matter for necessary action. The commission's decision, which was conveyed in a letter with reference, um, with the reference number identification to the Inspector General of Police today, Sunday, August 1st, 2021, was, assi was signed by Honorable Justice Clara Bota Bata Ogun B, a retired justice of the Supreme Court and Honorable Commissioner one in the commission for the commission's chairman, Alaji Musiliu Smith, a retired inspector general of police who is currently on leave. Okay, cool. Um, I think we sort of already know that, you know, he's been suspended. Um, and yeah, I think, I mean, some people are saying that's not enough, but really, actually, it is enough because he's just been accused until when he's proven guilty or not, that's when they can get him back or um or actually you know fire him but the fact is at this point uh, suspension is okay enough because such attention is not really needed and of course you know such bad publicity may not you know be favorable to the nigerian police at the moment right now especially internationally uh so yeah somebody else says very good news the blood of the innocent bia france he killed are averaging all right um okay some people say here that do not be surprised if the FBI managed to take Abakari out of this country. It would be the last Nigeria will see of him. America would take him their own. America don't kill intelligent people regardless of their crime. They rehabilitate them and put them to higher responsibility and authority. Um, well, let's see what will happen. I'm not going to lie. Um, you see that intelligent... I mean, okay, not to be disrespectful. I don't know anything about him. I don't know his credit and order. So... Um, it's like, you see that intelligent? Like, yes, I understand he's Nigeria's most decorated officer, but by whose merits? Because really and truly, if you're good, you're going to be popular, right? Like, well, I'm assuming, especially in the political space of how good he is, especially if his peers are seeing him that way, then of course they will promote him, right? Because really and truly, he's only coming to the scene fairly recently in terms of popularity, not, you know, his experience. So yeah, we'll see what will happen. Um, but he would have to go to court. Uh, someone says, but why should we be hasty in helping our enemies kill the best among us? My heart is beating right now. What? He committed a crime. A crime against, well, associ well associated with people in another country. And, they, and they're seeking for justice. Excuse me. Somebody else says, um, they should kill him immediately. Okay, that's a bit extreme. Um, scene one, act one. We are following it. Listen, energy. This is the energy I'm talking about. I'm like, I just enjoy this. Really, like, just enjoy this moment because, again, it's like as if Nigerian politicians have any way to flip the whole situation and make sure that the results are biased or anything. They can't do that. So, really and truly, we just have to be excited, I guess. In, in my opinion, I think we should be excited because, um, we will probably see the fairest, you know, dealing with a politician or anyone in government for the first time. And it would be fun. Get your popcorn. Act one, scene one. We are here and we are watching. Um, another comment here says, like play, like play. Okay, I'm not going to read that. <laughs> um, I commend the IGP and the police service commission for their swiftness on this particular case. Swiftness? Because America is involved. Listen, we've had worse cases of this and they would not even move an inch. Even when it comes to internal issues that have been you know, more intense than this, please. Um, any person is happy about what happened to Carrie. The person is a criminal. God will continue to expose criminals in Nigeria. 
Um, what? I'm I'm so confused. Yeah, I don't think that comment made sense. Maybe it did, but I'm not even gonna try to understand what, what that was. Uh, somebody here says a problem in Nigeria are the people the government have guns that have given guns to protect the citizens. The guy should not be tried after confirmation. He should be hung up to be to eliminate his kind in our society. Uh, if anything, in a kind of Nigerian society, you give them the more reason for them to be smart about how they go around with their criminal activities. Don't go to lie, even with Hush Puppy and that whole thing. If the FBI had to, you know, put a lot of strings together to break through some hard systems in which Hush Puppy was able to use to deceive Qatari businessmen. I'm not talking billionaires, billionaires, you know. Uh, someone here says, um, the only way to go, that is a good idea. Uh, what are they to investigate? Is the evidence provided not clear enough that the super cop is indeed guilty of the said crime? Li- literally, and again, the, what the evidence that has been given against him is not even what, not is not even up to the amount that will be used in court to sufficiently prove beyond reasonable doubt that this man is guilty. Please, um, just join APC. Your sin is forgive me. You hear me, so. <laughs> Wow. Um. Uh, again, maybe this should not really be the. I mean, again, it's Nigeria, so again, does I don't think it would matter. I don't think it would, it would affect anything for him internally because he has his connections and all that. Uh, but internationally, absolutely, it would affect his image, affect his bag, affect everything. Um, and I guess that's what he gets. Again, I mean, he associated himself with, you know, uh, a uh, uh, fraud stand. Of course, if he had not received any money, let's say that okay, fine, it was only negotiations. But then the act of you know, arresting um, uh opponents and actually sending money or receiving money from his account, I mean, receiving money into his account from Hush Puppy, if those things are not happen, but then they only had conversation, then you think, you know, he'd be investigated. Absolutely not. So again, the communication with Hush Puppy may not really be the bad thing. Of course, yes, morally and, you know, you know, you know uh, aesthetically, just a bit... Uh, someone of his nature should not be hanging out with people like that or even has as friends but um i guess that's just what it is but i mean again he's been he's been suspended that's a good move they have to make that move um and to think that even the fbi said they contacted the federal government or the police the nigerian police twice to ask them and i'm like ah know these people for me <laughs> for fbi put what you think about this in the comment section below and don't forget to like and subscribe